Hi, I'm James from Golden Shiny Trading, the professional China EU market agent in EU City. Today, I'd like to bring you a comprehensive EU market guide, includes each floor in all five districts. After you watch this video, I believe you will learn more about EU wholesale market, the biggest commodity market in the world, with over 75,000 suppliers in this market. If you have more questions, please leave comments below description. All right, let's get to straight. Now, to those who don't know about EU wholesale market, a trusted China EU market agent, here we specifically made a full layout about EU wholesale market. The highlight in map is the famous EU wholesale market. In fact, it's the biggest wholesale market in the world. This is recognized by the United Nations. More than 75,000 suppliers in whole EU market. To clarify, there are a total of five districts in EU wholesale market. As a professional China EU market agent, we will show you one by one here in the map. We start from District 1, A to E section. Move up a little is District 2, F section. Next to F is District 2, G section. Keep going is District 3, H section. The next is District 4. The last is District 5. Now, there are a total of five districts, as you can see clearly in this map. Let's take a look inside EU wholesale market, each floor in District 1 to 5. In the next, we will introduce you each floor in each district. For the record, there are a total of five districts in EU wholesale market. You will learn three main floors in district one to four and four main floors in district five. As professional China EU market agents, our introduction in this video not only includes products on each floor, but also how to deal with suppliers and our more than seven years sourcing experiences in the EU wholesale market. Now let's start from District 1. As professional China EU market agent, we'd like to answer your first question. What products on each floor in District 1, A to E sections? Well, first floor is artificial flower, flower accessories, plush toy, plastic toys, ordinary toys, L-flayed toy, electric toy, and a common toy. Moreover, you could click top right to check more about each floor in District 1. EU wholesale market is for wholesale but you still can purchase cargo in retail in some areas in the market. In fact, a lot of customers come here to buy some toys as souvenirs for their families and friends. In general, business procedure is simple in EU wholesale market. However, managing all orders and shipments are not as simple as you think, and it requires us to follow every step to avoid any mistake. Products on second floor is hair ornaments, jewelry, etc. For the long time, jewelry industry has been strong suited to the EU city. They are exported to a lot of countries in the world over the years. One main reason is 
that it has high quality with acceptable price, which attracts a lot of buyers to come to EU wholesale market every year. Furthermore, those jewelry suppliers update their design frequently to get more orders from different buyers in different countries. Just because the booming jewelry industry in EU city, it makes the jewelry section the most expensive rent among all districts in EU wholesale market. That's why you can see almost all shops are split into two shops simply because the rent here is too high for single one shop. Third floor is festival arts, decorative arts, porcelain, ceramic crystal, tourist arts, travel crafts, photo frame, jewelry accessory. When you are walking inside, you will find that it really doesn't matter whether those booths are traders or factories. To a lot of customers, the point is whether or not they can give you a favorite product and a price. As a professional China EU market agent, we will try to help customers make a deal with direct factories in EU wholesale market if the quantity is big. On the other hand, some traders or agents are more flexible on MOQ, which is minimum order quantity as mentioned. No matter whatever your quantity is, customers can always make a deal with suppliers here. Without a doubt, negotiation skill will be used widely in EU wholesale market. As professional China EU market agent, we always help customers get the best price with our negotiation skill. On the other hand, more and more foreigners are learning Mandarin for business purpose nowadays in EU wholesale markets. However, learning Mandarin is a very difficult task unless you live in China for many years. To most customers who come to EU for a few days, time is precious. So they need a professional and a reliable EU market guide from China EU market agent like us. Above all, it's not just a language problem. In order to get your sourcing plan done perfectly, we have to do more. As a professional EU market agent in China, we provide a one-stop sourcing service, such as airport pickup, EU market guide, order checking, quality control, warehouse facility, container loading, and shipping. Products on first floor in F section district 2 is poncho, umbrellas, poly bags, suitcase bags, and school bags. You have to click top right to check more about each floor in District 2. Certainly, you may have questions like, where are those supplies from in EU wholesale market, etc. Well, the reason we can tell you as a professional China EU market agent is the supplies in the market are not only from local EU city, but also from different cities and provinces across whole China. Therefore, EU city is international trade hub to most buyers. Some people call you is just another Dubai in China. Most importantly, you can find different suppliers are selling the same product in EU wholesale markets. You might want to know whether they need to order big quantity in EU market or not. Well, you don't have to worry about that. Although EU wholesale market is all about wholesale business, you still could get your small quantity orders done in EU wholesale markets. You might be better off dealing with trading companies rather than manufacturers in EU wholesale market because sometimes traders are more flexible on quantity and price. They are willing to sell you small quantity that manufacturers will not do. If you come to EU wholesale market the first time or lack of import experiences, then distinguishing manufacturers from traders will be challenging to you if you do not have professional EU market guide in EU wholesale market. Next is second floor. The products on second floor are locks, electric products, hardware tools, fittings, etc. As I mentioned before, supplies not only from local, but also from other provinces. For example, most electric product suppliers are from Guangdong province. Hardware tools are mostly from Zhejiang province, Henan province, Shandong province, etc. Third floor has a kitchenware, home appliance, shaver, etc. Now, why you need a EU market agent like us? Well, if you come here alone, it could take you one or two weeks to finalize your container. On the contrary, when you have professional EU market agents like us in EU city, you only need a few days to finish one container. Because we know every corner in the market, we know how to convince suppliers on better price and flexible quantity. Compared to the old days, buyers need to take few hours by car or even by flight to meet different suppliers in different cities in China. Now, EU market gives you a great way to shorten your visit time and improve efficiency as well. Moreover, another advantage to buyers is they can compare products in different suppliers easily in EU market. The main products on first floor G section district to EU wholesale market are suitcases, bags, school bags, etc. You could click top right to check each floor in G section district 2. 
Now, where are those supplies from? A lot of suitcases and bag supplies in your wholesale market come from Rian City in Zhejiang Province. Some traders, some others come from different cities in China. Meanwhile, suppliers always follow the world fashion trend by updating their new designs every year. Now, more and more suppliers have their own brands and designs because of intellectual property issue, which is good for business in the long term. When you look at the big picture, isn't it? The main products on second floor G section district two in your wholesale market are hardware tools, fittings, vehicle class, etc. Good quality and acceptable price are the most two reasons that attract worldwide buyers coming here to purchase commodities in your wholesale market. Moreover, suppliers can customize your products based on your own requirements, which is OEM. OEM is very popular in EU market, especially to the big buyers, because they usually have their own designs on their products. Now, I'd like to talk about a few things. Firstly, MOQ is negotiable. You can always find a small MOQ for the off-the-shelf item with best price in EU wholesale market, Secondly, suppliers are intensively gathering in a given aisle up on their product categories. Therefore, it makes customers easier to inquire, compare prices, and quality. Thirdly, convenient global logistics system. It takes care of products you purchased in your wholesale market to your home the whole way. It can be done easily by professional EU market agents like us. Fourthly, centralized purchasing center is separated to cater to large buyers. Lastly, competitive price is guaranteed in EU wholesale market. The main products on third floor in EU wholesale market are clock, watches, telecommunication equipment, electronic instrument, photographic equipment. To clarify, those products shipped by EU market agents to the world every day. Although there is minimum order quantity for each product, customers still can lower the MOQ by negotiating with suppliers if necessary. Meanwhile, it is always easier to negotiate if customers have market agent with them. Without a doubt, now is the internet world and e-commerce are flourishing everywhere. Therefore, EU wholesale market also catch up to the trend. EU market developed its own app that allows you to find products on your smartphone. For example, you tap some products in this app, it will show you all relevant products and booze details in the market. Above all, there are attributes about products and contact info as well. In summary, you can contact the suppliers right away and inquire prices in your smartphone. So you guessed it, now the EU wholesale market is not only physical market, but also giant online market. We switch to District 3. The main products on first floor here are pens, inks, paper articles, glasses. This district, also known as Office Supplies District. If you want to know more about each floor in District 3, please click top right. In fact, you could find all items related to Office Supplies in this District 3. Most of paper products are from Wenzhou City, which the city is famous of printing industry to buyers. Actually, if you spend days or weeks in here, then you will find that most of suppliers are from Wenzhou City. It's like fabric suppliers are basically from Kachau City. Electronic product suppliers are from Shenzhen City, etc. In conclusion, many cities have their dominant industries in China. But the amazing thing about EU City is that its EU wholesale market is able to gather them all in EU market, which makes EU market have all types of industries and the suppliers to attract worldwide buyers to come and do import and export business, which leads us to next question. How to manage from A to Z in EU wholesale market? Well, below example, we'll clarify it. Firstly, make a list for all products before we start sourcing in EU wholesale market. For instance, if there are 10 different products, it's necessary to confirm 10 suppliers who can offer best price. We usually prepare extra five to six suppliers for customers. In this case, customers are easy to choose which supplier is good to them in the EU wholesale market. Last is our one-stop sourcing service. It includes airport pickup, EU market guides, order tracking, quality control, warehouse facility, container loading, and shipping. As one of professional EU market agents in EU city, we will be totally responsible for customers' every procedure on their shipments. The main products on second floor are office suppliers, stationery, recreation, sporting articles, sport equipment, 
those supplies in here are from different provinces and cities in China. Remember that a variety of supplies and products is one of the most important factors to buyers. In that way, buyers can compare products among different suppliers and choose best one for them. On the other hand, the different suppliers have their own target market. Some suppliers' products are from Middle East market, some are from African market, etc. Therefore, your wholesale market fits a variety of buyers from all over the world. The main products on third floor is cosmetic, beauty products, mirrors, comb, apparel accessories. According to our previous EU market guide, you can find every part clothes accessories in this area. So this is the right place to apparel wholesale buyers. Moreover, because the value of each piece is not high, some items usually sold by pack. For example, rhinestones are packed by small bag, includes 1,440 pieces. There is also eyeshadow palette, pressed powder, perfume, wig extension, concealer, highlighter, lipsticks, eye bronze, blushers, etc. In another word, you are able to find almost everything related to beauty stuff on this floor. Products on first floor district 4 in wholesale market are sock, leggings, etc. You can click top right for more details about each floor in district 4. For those products, according to our experiences as EU market agent, our suggestion is either bring your sample or confirm shop sample to finalize the orders. For example, you can let a shop produce you design or choose shop sample design with your own color or logo. However, the best way we suggest is bring your own sample when you come to your wholesale market. With that being said, if customers want to look for new types of products, choosing supplier sample is also a good way to go because some suppliers are very professional in their industry. Once you confirm the products and the supplies in your market, please make sure you do formal contract with suppliers. The main product on second floor is hats, cap, gloves, daily necessities, knitting products, etc. In fact, you will find there are traders and direct manufacturers in here. Those suppliers come from everywhere in China, from China north to south, west to east. As a result, it makes EU wholesale market as international trade hub. As a professional EU market agent, if you have enough time to explore in EU wholesale market, you will learn that there is nothing you couldn't find in here if you have enough time. You might not believe this, but that's what happens to the buyers who come and buy in EU wholesale market. The main products on third floor are towel, woolen yarn, shoes, lace, necktie, tie, lines, cadets, sewing thread, and tape. Those products are mostly garment accessories. You can get many different quantity in your specific needs, quality from top to down, price from high to low. For the garment buyers, they will definitely visit this floor also because a lot of accessories about the garments are here. For example, if you are clothing factory in your country, you will need accessories like bottoms, needles, neckties as well. So you definitely want to do purchasing here if the price and the quality are acceptable to you. As a professional EU market agent, we will also sign contracts with suppliers in EU wholesale market. Now, one thing is the shops in the market just write a draft invoice for orders. However, this will become a tricky issue if something goes ugly about the order, such as quality is not identical, but similar quantity is short, package is different with the requirement, etc. Therefore, the best way to do is we write every detail that the customers want in invoice. Although people do business here almost based on each other's trust and words, we still think it might be risky and better do business contract to protect customers' interests as their EU market agent. The main products on first floor district 5 are health care products, handicrafts, clothing shoes and hats. You could click top right to check each floor guide in district 5. Also, there are other imported goods such as jewelry, textile, food, liquor, clothing, household items, daily consumable products, African products, exhibition, etc. For the start, first floor in District 5 is import products. As we know, EU wholesale market is mainly for export. However, in the recent years, EU government decided to develop not only export but also import. The goal is to drive domestic consumption as well as export. This is a bold idea because EU wholesale market only does exporting, but the EU government and EU market group 
are looking at a big picture. This will also become big contribution to the local economy. The main products on second floor is bedding products, Chinese knot, DIY handicraft. Suppliers on this floor are mostly from Nantong City. Bedding products is Nantong's dominant industry. On the other hand, most regular buyers come to here are from Middle East and African markets. They have huge demands on home textile products, especially the blanket and bed sheet items according to our experiences. Some big buyers will go directly to Nantong City for factory audit and product inspection, but to a lot of other buyers, the wholesale market is still the best choice to them. There are two reasons. Firstly, customers come to EU wholesale market mostly for many product orders, not only for one product. Secondly, MOQ requirement is very flexible in EU wholesale markets, not like direct factories. Direct factories usually will not accept small quantity orders. The main products on third floor is needed fabric, needed clothes, curtain fabric, textile materials, needle woven fabric, household products. Now three things I want to talk about this floor. Firstly, although the fabrics here are not as many as Kachau market, but we still strongly suggest customers check supplies on this floor because small quantity orders are more acceptable in EU wholesale markets. However, if you still couldn't find the right supplier, maybe you should go to Kachau fabric market. After all, EU and Kachau are only two hours by bus. However, according to our sourcing experiences, most customers will find what they want in EU wholesale market. Secondly, there are also boutique household supplies on third floor, and there are private label products in fashion design. Frankly, quality is very good and popular to buyers. Thirdly, you don't want to miss here if you're looking for high-end quality household products, because some products are at a very good price and in very good quality. Usually, those are provided by direct factories outlets. The main products on fourth floor distribute five or car accessories, such as rear mirror, bumper, hanger, backseat hooks, tires, steering wheel, cooling, heating cup holder, dash panel, seat cover, etc. Well, we can't name every part here because there are over 30,000 parts in one car. Moreover, there are many different brands for you when you are sourcing here. Famous brands like BMW, Mercedes, Toyota, Honda, General Motors, etc. The fourth floor is also called EU Auto Parts Market known as EU Automobile Accessories Wholesale Market. To a lot of car parts buyers, EU Auto Accessories Wholesale Market is the place where they do not want to miss. When you do business in EU Wholesale Market, there are three factors you need to consider ahead. Quality, quantity, and payment. First is quality. It refers to product description, size, material, shape, etc. We strongly suggest suppliers and customers confirm contract upon simple first. If there is no 100% same sample, then make one sample before production. In this way, factory just produce based on confirmed sample, which is also easier for us to monitor production for customers later. Second is quantity. When it comes to quantity, the professional term MOQ is familiar to buyers, which means minimum order quantity. This is to say in your wholesale market, every booth has different MOQ, so customers have to place order with minimum quantity, which is easy to understand in wholesale business. With that being said, to suppliers, although you need product profit is small, the total order profit still can be big. So is there any way to bend the rules? Yes, you could if you've got a good negotiation skill. According to our EU market guide experiences, a lot of suppliers will accept to use small quantity order for try orders then they will have a chance to get repeat orders in the future. Third is payment. Payment is always a tricky issue. As we all know, the money is leverage. So keep in mind that you do not have to pay money quickly until everything is confirmed. Maybe this sounds exaggerated to you. However, as professional EU market agents, we know clearly that risks will not disappear in the business. We've been providing EU market guide over seven years, so we know everything can happen in EU market. The key is we need to prevent it from happening to our customers. All right, above are pretty much about the EU wholesale market. I hope you can really learn about the EU wholesale market in this video, so you could prepare more before you come to EU market for sourcing products. As a professional China EU market agent, we are here to provide you one-stop sourcing service to make you sourcing easier, Welcome to contact us for more details about our business. Thank you very much for watching this.